Hey everyone, welcome back to another episode of Fergie Fresh Plays The Binding of Isaac. We're just going to get right into it today. I don't think I need an introduction. We're going to see how fast I can die. Hopefully I actually live, but I'm, I'm not holding my breath. So, uh, interesting bit of information. Uh, guess who has two thumbs and no job? Um, yeah, I, I got terminated today. Uh, not, not really terminated in, like, the terrible sense of the word, but, uh, terminated in the... I tried turning in my two weeks' notice, and they just said, See you later, hand in your badge. Uh, not like, you know, I don't work law enforcement or anything. I just had an access badge for the, the place where I worked. So, uh, yeah, that's fun. Uh, I guess that gives me more time to record videos. Whoa, whoa, calm down there, Pin. Alright, let's see if I can not repeat the last the last time I fought Pin with uh, technology. And actually try to win this time without getting, you know, hit a couple times, or a bunch. I, uh, I introduced a friend of mine to Northern Lion on the way into work today. Um, I think I may have given NL a subscriber. I don't really know, but uh, he <laughs> he definitely seemed to seemed to enjoy himself. I'm gonna go scan the rest of the floor see if I can't find a key somewhere before I go to the next one, because I, I definitely want to be able to go into my item room at least. Spider, spiders everywhere. All right, now that I got the health up, I think I'm gonna go ahead and try the uh, the curse room. Why not? Okay, not playing with that. And we're gonna bomb our way into the secret room instead of uh, using using the health on the way through there. And it was a good investment. That almost frees me up for the shop in the next uh, the next level as long as I can find two keys. If, if I only get one, I'm, I'm definitely going to opt for the uh, the item room over the shop. And let's go. Still in the basement. Okay. Kite these guys down around here. Or not. I guess, guess everybody's got to have an outlier somewhere. And we're going to try the cursed room. Hopefully this time it gives me something good, and not... Okay, we didn't get bombs, so that's that's nice. Let's see what we got here. Tears down! Not that big of a big of a hit with uh, technology. And full health. Well, at least we know it's in the rotation now. Kind of sad I used it right there, but whatever. In, uh, in retrospect, I definitely should have walked out of the room first, just in case it was a full health pill, but you live, you learn. I have a bomb, and I'm probably going to use it to get to that chest, but I wanted to make sure we don't have any tinted rocks laying around here anywhere. I'm pretty proud of myself today. I haven't said spirit rock or item shop when I meant item room. I, I haven't been taking a whole lot of dumb damage. I mean, I've, I've taken some dumb damage, but not, not a lot of it. Not nearly as much as usual. So I'm really hoping I can uh, make it to Mom again. That'd be nice. I'd be, I'd be happy with that. And we're going to go for the Tinted Rock and hope it gives me a key. Hope, hope, hope. Of course. <laughs> gives me the exact opposite of a key. Alright. Monstro. This shouldn't be too hard. I Looks like I'll be able to keep him bouncing around the level. Nope. I thought I'd... Uh, Thought I had him locked in that that jump. Uh, yeah, that. Thought I had him locked into one of those. Ah! I I almost thought I had that dodged, but I guess I guess not. I don't think he can hit me from that distance. He can definitely hit me from that distance. All right. A little while longer. There we go. Cat of Nine Tails, definitely not the best pickup in the world, but whatever. I don't think there's anything else I can do on this floor. Nope, because it's a boss trap room. I have to have spirit hearts to go into there. I'm sorry. I'm, I'm going to go double check real quick, and I think I'm going to try for this instead of for the... Oh, no, I used my bomb. 
getting checking the checking the tinted rock. Darn it. Alright, well, on to the next level, I guess. No no item rumor shop for me. Alright, here's to hoping I can find some keys. Another curse room. Alright, two spirit hearts, not too bad. Alright, troll bomb. Use half of one of these spirit hearts on the way out, so I ended up with a net of one and a half spirit hearts. How is he not dead yet? Thank you. You, go away too. Alright, let's get rid of these guys because I don't want them zipping across the screen and killing me. Well, taking taking life. And this guy should be fairly easy because he's just going to try and run from me. Alright, come on. Somebody somewhere give me a key. These guys are kind of dangerous because there's a chain reaction thing that can happen and then I get hurt and I'm not okay with that, so... Sure would be nice if I could kill one of these guys. I need a damage up. Badly. There's one. Alright, two, three. And come on, number four. Four. Alright, and another spirit heart. Nice. Okay, I do not like this room, because that's going to happen. Yeah. I'm going to take a lot of damage right here. A lot of damage. Yep. Man! I, I hate the room with those and the nowhere to move. There was literally nothing I could have done there. It's so frustrating just watching Isaac die. Alright. This guy just apparently his firing mechanism's broken. Okay, got rid of him fairly quickly and. Alright. See, now I can escape these guys. This I'm okay with. I can move about the cabin freely and not, you know, constantly get hit and chased into a corner. Uh, okay. Alright. Mini mush, speed plus range. It makes me a little smaller, and uh, the range upgrade doesn't do much, but the speed's going to be nice, because I felt like I was going pretty slow there. And I think I may check... Yeah, there's, I don't think there's any way to get that rock and check for the secret room. Let's see what happens. Alright, I got lucky. And more money. Nice. If I can get a, uh, well, I was going to say if I can get a deal with the devil, but it's a little, little low on health right now for a deal with the devil. Alright. Let's see what the boss turns up. Fistula. I don't like this because he's going to shatter and turn into a bunch of little fistulas. And apparently I also have absolutely no damage at all. Alright, the best way to deal with these, I think, is to isolate and eliminate, but I'm clearly not very good at that. Let's see if I can take out this bomb fly before he takes me out. And the answer to that is no. <laughs> I'm not, not liking the, the direction this room is taking here, but I, I, you know, these guys are kind of predictable because they just follow the, the geometric path. Alright, now I should be good. Hey, and there's some hearts back. I'll take it. Range upgrade, which I don't really need, courtesy of, uh... Alright, let's go check at least. That way I can walk away and... Hey, another half heart. I would love to take Spirit of the Night, which is what I think this is, but I just, I can't... I don't think I can make peace with losing two hearts. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna go. I don't have any keys, let's just go. I think, I think in the long run I've, I've improved my survivability. I, I didn't like walking away from, from Spirit of the Night, but... 
sometimes you, you gotta do what you gotta do. These turrets are obnoxious. Get rid of these fly guys if I can, because I can hit them from across the map. All right. Ah! This is really, really frustrating. I my kingdom for a damage upgrade. All right, down to one fly, a and a troll bomb. Really. Insult to injury. All right. I was, if I got hit by one of those eyeless guys, I was going to be really upset. All right. I don't think I can chance the uh, the curse room right now. I've already kind of had a good payout from there, so I'm going to go look for a key and maybe look for a uh, look for a key and maybe look for the the secret room. hide behind this rock here, which is really handy. Alright, down to one. Come on. There you go. Good boy. Alright, pressing onward. Hopefully I can find a heart somewhere. This is going to be mildly difficult. Really, uh, really nerve-wracking trying to navigate these spikes. Okay. All right. And then there was one. Come on. Come on. A little longer. Hey, that was handy. More money. Man, if I could just find a key and go to the shop... That, that would just be great. <laughs> wow, these guys have a pretty, pretty wicked fire rate. Good thing my fire rate's better. I mean, my rate's good, but my, my damage per shot is just awful. Come on. Duh. Oh, I tried. All right, well, this has been Fergie Fresh Plays The Binding of Isaac. Hopefully you guys at least had some fun laughing at me failing. I will see you next time.